neurons are also formed in the adult brain. Scientists have found further evidence that adults are also new neurons are emerging. Neurogenesis occurs in the hippocampal parts of the brain committed to learning, memory and emotions. Scientists have been struggling with the question of whether the brain of an adult has been struggling for decades man creates new neurons. Until recently, it was believed that the process of neurogenesis, the process of formation of new neurons, inhibits with age, and eventually it's going to stand completely. In 2013, Research group Jonas Friesen from Karolinska Institute has shown that new neurons may form in adult hippocampus people. Then came works that contradicted these arrangements, but showed research confirms them, too. In 2018, researchers at Columbia University studying brains dead people found that in healthy, adult males and women can create as many new brain cells as in younger people. A year later scientists from the Autonomous University of Madrid have come to similar conclusions. Spanish researchers also analyzing the brains of deceased people, found young neurons, even in the elderly. But these studies have been questioned because it was not clear whether young urns were created in adults the brain, or they've been there since childhood. In new work, scientists armed with artificial tools intelligence, they found further evidence that neurogenesis also occurs in the adults. In the publication, which appeared in the journal Science, researchers from Karolinska Institute and Chalmers University of Technology in Sweden show that new neurons are formed in adults in the hippocampus part of the brain responsible for memory, learning ability, or emotion. In their work, Scientists have identified cells progenitor neurons in the hippocampus. Progenitor cells also known as cells precursor, these are stem cell progeny cells. They have limited the ability to differentiate and usually form cells belonging to this the tissue itself or the organ. We were able to identify these cells, which confirms that in the hippocampus of an adult human brain, the process of formation nurse neurons, said Frizen, who led the new research. In these works, scientists have combined several advanced techniques for the analysis of brain tissue of people up to 78 years from several of the international biobanks. They used a method called single sequencing RNA nuclei that analyzes gene activity in single cell nuclei and flow cytometry to study the properties of cells. Combining it with artificial intelligence models that have been trained to identify progenitor cells based on the activity of about 10,000 genes, were in the state to identify neurons at various stages of development, including young neurons in the brain tissue of deceased people between the ages of 20 and 78. In further study, the researchers found that the newly created the cells were located in a specific hippocampal area called the gear. This area is important for creating memory, learning and flexibility it's a cognitive thing. It is the main site of neurogenesis in children and some adults the animals. Researchers also observed that some adults had many progenitor cells of neurons, others almost at all. Commonly it is known that in rodents, environmental and genetic factors affect the level neurogenesis, so I suspect that the differences between people are also due to genetic and environmental factors, Friesen said. In general, younger brains had more cells progenitor than older and brain tissue 5 out of 14 adults in a set the data had no perceptible progenitor cells. We're adding another important piece to the puzzle that is understanding how the human brain works and changes throughout life. Our research they may also be important for the development of regenerative treatments that stimulate neurogenesis in neurodegenerative and psychiatric disorders he explained to Frizen. 3 one
I'm so-